Hey, Belfry, I'm at the Orchard Hotel. The balcony door should be open. That's your entry point. A penthouse with a balcony? You spoil me, Belfry. Hands off the minibar. Our days of unlimited budgets are behind us. Belfry, I'm in. The court sure found themselves a swanky hangout. Remember to find a safe place to eavesdrop in the ballroom. If security sees you, you're toast. The party's already started in the ballroom. Good thing I remembered my mask. So does mine. and the guards' comms. Good work. And remember, those guards out there are actually court members. Don't hesitate to take them down. Oh, and that's how I get in. Belfry. I'm entering the ballroom. Nice work. Time to see how many of these rich snobs are court members. Wait. Did you hear about Langstrom's assistant? He deserved to be let go. Just like Kirk, people forget their place. The voice remembers. Yeah, those match. Where the hell is the voice? <laughs> Look at this. Even in death, Wayne tries to outdo us. Let him have his final hurrah. After tonight, it won't be a problem. You're right. His death ought to be a celebration. What do you think this is? Got a few matches. Won't have to listen to these assholes for much longer. Did you sign the guest book? How could I not? I've got people to impress. Did you see some of the names in there? I did. Senators, judges, CEOs, even the mayors here. Business is good. Great evil. Who would have thought this would give the rest of us such a kick in the pants? Sorry to interrupt, but it's time. Ah, of course. We'll have to continue this later. Gotcha. He's not even trying to hide it. 
Thank you all for the warm welcome. But tonight is not about me. We are here to remember one of Gotham's greatest sons, Bruce Wayne. Now, you all knew the Playboy. I knew his charity. A brash defender of Gotham's best. Though he's gone now. Bruce's contributions to this city will be felt for decades to come. This is for you, Bruce. The last of our precious Wayne family. You've helped us in ways you never realized. And may we, the surviving families of Gotham, strive to live up to your inimitable legacy. for the voice of the court. Well done. Now stay on him. Maybe we'll get lucky and he'll take off his mask. more Dionysium to meet their production deadline. I'm aware. Arrangements are being made. Let them know that I expect the quota to be met. No excuses. Thank you, sir. If it pleases the court. Excellent. I'll see you downstairs.
Crick got in a secret elevator, then dropped off the radar. Same here. I lost track of him between floors. Red Hood, we just found a hidden 13th floor in the hotel blueprints. Maybe that's where the voice went. Stop. 13th floor. Rich weirdo VIP room. Belfry, I'm on the 13th, and I found one of those Court of Owls doors. Understood. Tread carefully. wants to play hide and seek. Great. Belfry, got any tips to find the voice? Belfry, you there? Damn it, cut off again. for that meeting. Let's see what they were looking at. Just what we need to bring them down for good. But there's still plenty to clean. Destroy everything. Make it so Langstrom never existed. We must send a message. You That's a lot of names. Hold on. All these people are either missing or dead. Kirk Langstrom is on here. Is this a hit list? of Gotham's architecture. Was the court involved in construction, too? This must have something to do with the dates on the wall. It's 
Or what? So you made it here, all by yourself. Well, someone had to stop you from destroying Gotham. Destroy Gotham? Now we're trying to save her. Preserve her glory. I understand now the potential you could have to do the same. Oh. Power and glory. Hmm. Never had that offer from a weirdo in a mask. The only one hiding behind a mask is you, Mr. Todd. Jacob Kane? How? How do you know? I know. Just like I knew my nephew Bruce was out there, keeping the peace in his armored pajamas. <laughs> Don't worry, I didn't tell anyone. Call it loyalty to Martha. We all live double lives, trying to shelter the city from chaos. It's just, our court is quiet about it. The people of Gotham will find out you've been playing with their lives. They're not your toys. Yeah, Batman would probably say the same thing in your position. That's why I never told Bruce about the court. We have the same ends. The same enemies. It's madness. You're not serving us. I stopped killing people. <laughs> A difference in tactics, I'll admit. You say you protect Gotham, but you're racking up a body count. Kirk Langstrom, his assistant... Those who betray us will suffer for it. Langstrom betrayed the court. Bruce gave everything to save this city. You fight for yourselves. You would never have supported this. Do not use my nephew against me. I mourn Bruce. I want answers for his death. Just like you. I am nothing like you, Jacob. Understood. I protected Bruce, but I won't protect you. If you won't join us, I'm afraid you'll have to join Langston. Stay out of my way. You won't like what happens next. We've gotta get back to the ballroom, Asa.
God damn it! These people don't stand a chance against me. Red Hood. and brightest at the Orchard Hotel is a new low for the city of Gotham. It is time for the real heroes, the GCPD, to step up and restore order in our city. To take it back. Yeesh. Surprisingly, Commissioner Kane isn't a match for any of the voices we collected. Hey! She may not be a court member, but the Commissioner could still be helping them. She did marry Jacob. Catherine is probably not aware of her husband's secret. I know Jacob well, and have never had even the slightest suspicion. Colonel Asshole fooled everyone. Even Bruce. The other people we matched at the ball. John Wycliffe? Isabella Haas? Maria Powers. All killed at the hotel by the league. Colonel Kane's the only member we know survived for sure. And probably old lady Cobblepot. She's unaccounted for. And the court is clearly much bigger than Jacob Kane and Constance Cobblepot. The almighty voice was right, you know. No one will believe a nursery rhyme's been pulling Gotham's strings for so long. But people will believe that Jacob Kane conspired to murder Langstrom. We have the evidence to prove it. Let's get this to Detective Montoya. See if it's enough for her to build her case. I'll be sure to include our list of known members, dead or otherwise. We need to be careful about this. Jacob will be waiting for us to try something. Someone should talk to Talia. The court and the League are clearly out to kill each other. And let's be ready when we're caught in between them. I added new evidence to the board. 